Hello, I'm Dr. Robert Lelouch, a board-certified OBGYN physician with over 30 years of clinical experience. And today we're going to address the topic that I hear a lot, is all natural best? So is it best to go the natural way or to go the man-made way or to go with medicines or what nature intended? And the simple answer is it's not a simple answer. It depends. It depends on the circumstance. We definitely are finding more and more that as far as diet, food, going with nature seems to work a lot better than our processed, hyper-processed foods. So fruits and vegetables, things that grow on trees, things that come from the ground seem to be much better for your health uh, than eating prepackaged uh, foods that are highly processed that's leading um, in part to our uh, obesity epidemic in the United States and spreading throughout the world where there's more and more processed foods. That being said, sometimes mother nature isn't all that nice and going with just natural is the wrong choice. See, mother nature is lions eating zebras. It can be cruel. It doesn't have an interest and keeping you around for a long time. Mother Nature doesn't necessarily. So a lot of what we do in medicine is to counter the natural process. Uh, 200 years ago, life expectancy was in the 30s. Now it's in the 80s, give or take. Um, and a lot of that is by getting medications um, that you can think of as natural or not natural. How are they not natural? Well, we, they're man-made. We come up with them. How can we think of them as natural? Well, about 60 to 70% of all medicines come from plants and herbs. So over the years, when we've discovered some plants or herbs have had a positive effect, pharmaceutical companies, researchers, scientists have investigated, tested, and analyzed and figured out what are the ingredients in the herbs that had the desired effect. Um, like aspirin, for example. And they were able to refine it, to take out the impurities, to find and test what's the right dose, too little having no effect, too much having side effects, and to give you a nice safety protocol and give you some benefits. So that's, that's uh, uh, why sometimes taking medicines may or may not be considered <laughs> an, a, a natural approach, but uh, it's what keeps us alive longer, keeps us healthier longer, is these interventions. So rather than having an all natural approach in all circumstances, um, I, I encourage you to have a open and honest discussion with your physician, with your provider, and see when uh, natural is the best way to go and where sometimes uh, looking at it differently might give you a better longer, healthier life with better outcomes. I hope you found this helpful. Please leave your comments. Thank you.